Well, well, well. Good evening, guys. Hello, hello. How are you? Robert, hello, my friend. How are you? Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening. I'm How fine. Fine. I'm fine. That's great. That's great. How was the day for you? It was very busy. That's kind of normal. I was working. Right? Yeah, I was working so hard. Yeah, that's life. That's life. But at least you are home resting. <laughs> yeah, that's Enjoy, that's you know, the family. That's important. That's important. Spending time with yeah. family time. Yeah, family time is always good. I mean, actually, that's the most important aspect of life. Yeah. Of course, the job is important, but, I mean, we have to balance. Yeah, we need to have a balance between work and family. Yes, sure, of course, of course. I mean, and, and when the opportunity arises, we must spend as much time as we can with them. Yeah, yeah. So, well, how old is your son? Uh, he is good. He is doing well. How old is he? How old? I, I'm, I'm sorry. I I heard you You yeah, said no, how no, well. No, no. How well. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, teacher? Yeah? You got problem with your micro again? Okay. I heard you a little bit far again. No, but actually that's... Uh, 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 no. There is a little bit difference between yesterday. Okay, let me see. Can you ask to can you ask around? Let's see, what about now? I heard you the same. Okay, hold on. Let me check. Let's see, what about now? How do you feel? Uh, nothing changed. No, yeah, but I mean, that's the, that's the mic. As Maybe says. you need to change your microphone or you have to set it. No, actually, I'm in the, I'm in the setup. I'm in the setup and let's see. According to yeah. the test, let me see. I'm testing. Okay, okay. Let's see, let's see. Uh, 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 uh. It's just that when you when we change microphones, we need to to set it up different. Yeah, I, I I understand. You need to have a lot of work. Yeah, these things are kind of problematic, you know. Yeah. No, that was even worse. Let's see. Okay, 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 okay. So, what time did you get home, Robert? Uh, mm, 5 p.m. o'clock. At that hour, I arrive at home. 5 p.m., wow. That, you, was, that was kind of early. You ask, you ask, yeah, yeah, you asked me how old is my son. He is yeah. nine, He's nine, nine, oh nine years old. I forget to I, I I forgot to give you the answer. Yeah, yeah, nine years old, gosh. That's so cool. Yeah. That's cool actually. I mean it's nice, it's nice. Let me see. We're gonna check something. We're gonna try something. Wait a second, please.
Okay, okay, let's see. Well, well. Okay, I'm sorry, I was fixing up a little something here. So, well, Robert, always a pleasure to have you here. Welcome to the it's class. It's a pleasure for me, teacher. Thank you. Let's see, Walter Reyes. Hello, good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. I'm just fine, just fine. You know, same old story as usual. And tell me, how was your day? Did the, you have a good day? The present day, uh, I prepare a request uh, to send a production floor. And so our day with the, the sun routine. The same, the same the routine. Same, the same routine. Okay, okay. Yes, well, yes, yes, it's all of it. Routine, not it. Every day is the same. Well, yeah, you know. What can we do, right? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer? Sí. Oh, let me get fancy. Wait a second, guys. So the same as usual, mister. Walter, Walter, where did Walter go? Hola, hola. Oh. The same routine as every day. Yes. No le, no le escucho. No sé si usted me escucha. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling oh, you. Ahorita. Every day is the same, right? We gotta do the same stuff as usual. Perdón, no le entendí muy bien. I'm telling you that every day is the same. Cada día es lo mismo. We have to do the same as usual. Tenemos que hacer lo mismo de siempre. Yes. Eh, yes. Siempre todos los días como haciendo lo que es un requerimiento que dice producción. Usualmente tengo que hacer casi, casi todo lo, lo mismo pues siempre. Todos los días. Yeah, of course, of course, I understand you totally. But the good thing is that you are here in class. Welcome to the class, my friend. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Let's see. Hey, Jaime. Enjoying this fresh day? <laughs> Hello, teacher. How are you? Well, I'm fine, I'm fine. You know, same old story as usual. What about you, my friend? Um, nothing here with uh, 
hot day. Very hot. A very hot day. Yeah, the water um, is weather is very hot. Is possible uh thirty nine grados centígrados. Thirty nine. Yeah. That's a lot. Oof, horrible. <clears throat> I can imagine. Yes. In terrible, right? Yeah, no, pero. And what about the uh, nights? Uh, igual, igual. Okay, I guess you can hear me better now, right, guys? It's so very nice. Cool, yeah. cool. Excellent. Ya no se oye eco. Oh, man. Fighting with the system, recognizing my microphones. I got three different ones. Uh, <laughs> uno es el original, solo me dice. Yeah, it's <clears throat> a problem. But anyway, good thing is that now it's working. Yes. So, tell me, Jaime, how well you were telling me, what, how are the nights? Harder? Harder. Yes, very hard. It's difficult to sleep like that, right? Oof. Hay que bañarse unas dos, tres veces. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. <clears throat> well, I remember spending some time in Acajutla. I used to, I used to shower around midnight. Yeah. <laughs> every day. Wow. And during so the I, day, it, it, like it, two, it, three times. Yes. Así toca, así me toca todos los días. Yeah, I can't understand you. <laughs> Pero I mean, lo mal, lo malo, teacher, que no, no baja la panza ni nada. Está siempre igual. Oh, well, you know, it, it drops down, sí baja. To, to <laughs> A your las rodillas. Knees, yeah. <laughs> A las but, rodillas. But it's dropping down. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I mean, well, you know, it's just that a sauna, the, the function is different. It's, it's uh, obligatory. Mandatory. Mandatory. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but, well, what can we do, right? Yeah. That's the way it goes. That's the way it goes. Hi, man. Nice having you here. Welcome. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Let's see. Uh, 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 mm. Jose Edwin. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, I'm fine. Everything is cool? Todo bien, todo bien. Yes, yes. Excellent, excellent. Uh, uh, the uh, daily routine we have. The same routine as usual. Usually, always. Uh, what time did you get home today? Uh, today is... Um, Early? <laughs> Early. Uh, today early uh, at five. At five? Well, yeah, that's early. Did you have dinner already? Yes. Oh, I that's cool. I dinner early. That's nice. That's nice. What time do you usually have dinner? Uh, usually uh, uh five thirty. Uh, after uh, after I arrive. Right after you arrive. 
after I arrive. After I arrive. Okay. Okay. That's, that's early. Well, that's nice. I mean, it's good. So when the class finished, you can go to sleep. Like, uh, normal, right? what time do you go to sleep? Uh, my daddy, 10, uh, the most later, 10. Okay, okay. The latest is 10. Wow. 10 for me is very, very early. Very early. Oh. Uh, y aún yeah. así voy con sueño todavía el día siguiente. <laughs> yeah. Really? Mm. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, to be honest with you, I couldn't. I I couldn't go to sleep so early. Yo no podría. It's too early for me. Uh, the past week? Uh, last week? Yes, I... The last week, I was working in my house. Uh, and so I sleep to 12. On 11 30. Wow. Yes. That's early, very early. Very I'm sorry, that's late, very late. Yes. I I cannot yeah. sleep that much. It's impossible for me. Well, good for yeah. you, mister. Good for you. Thank you very much and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys, let's see. Let's see. Let me get the attendance. Okay, guys, let's check it out. Uh -huh. Ana Consuelo Amaya Merino. Ana María Rivas Durán. Present teacher. Thank you. Brenda Angélica Díaz de Chacón. Brenda. Oh, Brenda's here. Karen Beatriz Castillo Sensente. Present. Thank you, Brenda. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you, mister. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Thank you. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez Lemos. Present. Guillermo Josué Osorio Ventura. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present teacher. José Edwin Valle Franco. Present. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Thank you, Robert. Karen Patricia Ramírez Pérez. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. <laughs> Roberto Antonio Guzmán Rodríguez. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present, teacher. Thank you. Ruth Margot Benítez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Sandra Chamilet Alvarado Aguilar. Present, teacher. Sonia Guadalupe Santa María Cabrera. Present, teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Walter Manuel Reyes Campos. Present teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Ramos Escobar. Okay, let's see. 
still, yes, yeah, still got time, still got time. Gabriela, hello, how are you, miss? Gabriela Vázquez. Okay, let's see. Robert Guzman, hello, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. Hello, teacher. Oh, okay, okay. I'm sorry. Este, tengo, tengo problemas con el celular y me cuesta bastante. Aparte que estoy esquiz, o no sé cómo se dice, enferma. Sick. Sí. Okay, no problem, uh -huh. Gabriela. No problem, no problem. We will talk later. So, Robert, how are you? How was your day, mister? Fine. Mm, oh. My day, it, it was so-so. I can uh, quejar, no me puedo quejar. I can complain. I can complain. Um, really, really satisfactory. Okay, that's cool. What time did you get home? Today, I arrived to my home around uh, 6 p.m. Okay. A, a little, a a little, little bit, bit late. Um, late, late. Yeah, I can tell a little bit late. But the good thing is that usually, you're home. At what time do you get usually? Usually, I I, I arrive to home at 5.30. <coughs> Sorry. No problem, no problem. Well, the good thing is that you're home and you're in the class. That's what matters right now. So thank you very much and welcome. Thank you. Okay, guys, welcome all of you. <coughs> Today we are going to switch it a little bit. I got a question for you to think about. Do you think life will be more difficult or easier for our grandchildren? In what ways? What do you think? I mean... Do you think their life is going to be like more difficult or do you think things are going to be easier for them than they are for us? What's your opinion on that, guys? Well, in order to find your opinions, I want you to work in groups. For that question, we will have five minutes. I'll send you to the groups and then I'm going to ask you directly to some of you, okay? So I'm going to send you to the groups so you can discuss. I'm sending you right now, so let's jump in. Teacher, what is the meaning of grandchildren? Nietos.
Ajá, Catherine. Ajá, teacher. Tell me, how is it going to be for the 20 grandchildren you're going to have? Yeah. Así como a mí me ha costado que les cueste a <laughs> That's Son bromas. Bad. You are so bad. <laughs> Son bromas. No, but what do you think? It's going to be life easier for them or do you think that it's going to be more difficult? I think be more difficult. Todo va a estar más caro. Oh, really? Así pienso. <laughs> Ya no va a haber agua. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, water is going to be a problem very soon. Yeah. Va a estar más caliente el sol. Yeah, it's going to be a big problem, that one. Yes. And you, teacher? Me what? Don't ask me, you got Sandra, you got Roxana, ask them. No quieren. <laughs> Sandra, Roxana. Hi, teacher. You see, there's Sandra. <laughs> ah. De escondida. Hi, teacher. Que estoy dándome bien, te bien, te bien, te bien. <laughs> uh, don't worry, ladies. You know, for me, it's a problem right now. I got a headache. I got a toothache. I'm sorry? Uh, no, pero... <laughs> ¿De qué manera? De la economía. De cómo. ¿Crees que será más fácil? Yeah, but Catherine do doesn't have that problem. You know, she's got money. <laughs> she works for... For fun. <laughs> Ella trabaja por diversión. Catherine, Catherine no tiene hijos. No. Solo un perrijo. ¿Cuántos años tiene? Eh, 24. You should have like four or five. Debería tener unos cuatro o cinco. No. <laughs> años o hijos. No <laughs> años. Niños. No, hombre, más niños que yo. Ok. ¿Y usted, teacher, cuántos tiene? Juan. Juan. Yes. Ya le dicen abuelo. Mi verdad. I'm sorry. De edad, dice. Oh, I am 43. 43. Yep. And on the way down, y para abajo. Solo uno. Yes, just one. Está bien. Yeah, of course. No se comen ni se venden. Sí, cierto. Yo solo tengo uno. That's cool. They are hard. Salen caros. They are very expensive. Sí. Y a mí me está diciendo unos cuatro. <ríe> yeah, at least four. Unos cuatro debería tener. Primero deme usted el ejemplo. Tenga unos cuatro. <ríe> ¿Cuántos años tiene su hijo, teacher? He is 20, 21 yesterday, actually. He became oh. 21 yesterday. La edad de mi hermano. Ya está en la universidad. Yeah, he's in his fourth year. Mm -hmm. Yo este año hubiera terminado. What were you studying? ¿Qué estudiaba? Licenciatura en idioma inglés. <laughs> oh, really? Where were you studying it? ¿Dónde la llevaba? En la Universidad Tecnológica. 
Oh, that's so nice. Yeah. When did you stop? Huh? ¿En qué año se quedó? Empezando iba el primer año. Well, but it's never late. Nunca es tarde. No. <laughs> Algún día, primero Dios. Yeah, look. Continúe. El I mean, tiempo pasa bien rápido. Yeah, sure. Sure. Look at me. I mean, uh, last year I took one year. El año pasado tomé un año. And I'm still missing one. Me falta uno. Next mm -hmm. year, I'm sure, for sure, I'm going to finish it. El próximo año, seguro que termino. The, the second career. Termino la otra carrera. Nos invita I mean, a la graduación. I mean, I'm step by step, but I'm, I'm going to finish it. Yo sé que voy pasito a pasito, but I'm going to finish it. And ¿verdad? I'm 43, I mean. So if I can, you can. And you don't have kids. Y usted no tiene niños. You are not married. No está casada. So, come on, Catherine. <laughs> don't give me excuses. <laughs> Ay, se <Bien>, adelante. <laughs> Yeah, continue, continue. <laughs> ya no hicimos la tarea. Bueno, la ¿Cómo no? Este, bueno, yo le estoy poniendo, ¿verdad? Que creo porque será difícil. Primero por la economía, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Exactamente. La falta de agua. Sí, porque no sabemos cómo puede estar más adelante. Pues un planeta destruido. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice destruido? Destroyed. Destroyed. Ah, destroyed planet. Así se dice. Yeah. Sí. Destroyed. 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 Teacher. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice naturales? Natural. Natural. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Roxana. Why are, you... Yeah, why are you so quiet, Roxana? ¿Por qué tan callada? Yes, because of the information. Information. Ah. Of the And what? Inflación. Information. Repeat, please. Inflación. Oh, really? The inflation. Inflación. Also ¿Cómo pollution. Es? También la contaminación. There are many things, many aspects, right? Inflation. Okay, guys. I am so. Yes, I'm here checking out. Yo creí que se había salir. I'm here checking out, checking out. That Karen doesn't want to talk. No, no contesto, Karen. Yeah, yeah. It's because of Fatima. Fatima is always fighting with everybody. Fatima siempre está peleando. Hi, Fatima. How are you? Hi, teacher. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, okay, cool. Did you finish? Okay, that's cool. Let's go back to the main room. Okay. Yeah, no, Papa.
¿Dónde andaba? Qué raro. Right here, right here. Acá no nos hemos ido. Oh, it wasn't Monica. with us, Monica. Yeah, I thought Monica was telling me. Yo pensé que conmigo era. Ok, ok, let's see, let's see. Mm. Who's gonna start? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Uh, 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 David. Hello, David. Hello, teacher. Tell me, mister. Do you think life will be more difficult or easier for our children? Um, my opinion, uh, relative, and the in the advanced technology, I will make something easy. The technology is fácil algunas cosas, and the uh, the more difficult the the boy at the house. How difficult and um, the more difficult to 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 buy a um, house. Okay. Yeah. And the machine, the um, supplying, and the human, and the and the working. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's machines instead of people. Yes. Okay. Well, interesting. Interesting point of view. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see, let's see. Uh, 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 um. What's your opinion on this topic, Ruth? Hi, teacher. Mm. Yes, not difficult. difficult. Uh, it would be easy in, technolo en technology. Bueno, pensamos nosotros que es más fácil en ciertos puntos. It would be easy in technology. No sé, así se menciona, teacher. Así se pronuncia. Yeah, technology. Technology. And very difficult in survival. Survival to, to environmental contamination. Environmental. Environmental con contamination. <laughs> Creemos que. Eh, pollution. Pollution. Eh, sale esa en lugar de contaminación decimos pollution. Ok, that's ah. what you say, pollution. Okay, thank you. Okay, excellent, okay. excellent. Okay, let's see, let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Carla Beatriz Garcia, tell me, what's your opinion? Do you think life's gonna be easier or more difficult for our kids? No, teacher. Um, I agree that's not uh, because natural resources are running oh, and well, the environmental, no sé si así se dice, Environmental. Environmental. Impact is not even worsening, worsening global warming and overpopulation. The evolution of technology, technology, la technology. Technology. <laughs> technology has brought negative consequences in the world as well. Okay, okay. Perfect, thank you. Very specific thank you, answer. Teacher. Robert Beltran, what do you think? Hi, teacher. 
I remember, I was remembering about this topic uh, of my grandmother, because she told me many things about this topic. She always told me that I'm going to have a little bit problems because you know we don't we don't have the food about the technologies matching. So we have the food from the nature, from the environment. So therefore, I think in the future for our grand children it's gonna be more difficult to to live. It's a little bit um, I think it's gonna be difficult for they for them and for them, yeah. Uh, there will be more pollution in the environment, so therefore will be less food and of course the natural resources will be depleted and it's going to be living here a lot of people than today and that's i think that is the big problem that's the grandchildren's grandchildren's gonna have in the future grandchildren yeah and so i i i mean we we have to take care of the environment today thinking in the future okay perfect thank you okay that's it thank you thank you thank you i appreciate it okay guys next activity now we're gonna do some reading Okay, let's read the article about mistakes networking experience. We are going to discuss if the questions below are true or false and correct. Look, we have to correct the false sentences. Okay, if one is false, we are going to write what is the correct answer. Okay, so. Uh, 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 uh. Last week, I had lunch with Allison, a new member of my network contacts. We saw each other at three seminars over the past year, but we really did not know each other very well. I set a goal last year. I will have a one-on-one -on -one networking meeting with at least five new contacts this year. My fifth contact meeting was Allison. Our meeting was so rewarding that I want to share the experience. During lunch, during lunch, Allison mentioned that she was shy by nature. In the past, she said, she worried a lot before going to large networking events. I felt surprised because she trusted me that feeling. I got to know more about her the industry she works in, and about her expectations for the future. I gained more than a new contact. I passed from small talk to smart talk. Here is my advice to you. When you attend business events, do not just go and discuss business, problems, and solutions. Try to get to know at least three new people by sharing a one-on-one -on -one networking coffee, lunch, or dinner. There are several benefits of this practice. You expand your contacts, improve your networking skills, and you build meaningful connections with people in the industry. Okay, okay. Questions about the vocabulary. Is there any question about the vocabulary, guys? Uh, teacher, eh, eh, disculpe yes. lo que le voy a preguntar. Donde dice meaning, meaningful, así lo dijo. Yes, o, significativas, significa? meaningful. Uh -huh. 
significativos. Ah, ok. Okay, guys, any other question? Okay, okay, okay. Well, we have here a couple of questions. Look, let's look at it like this. Okay, it says here, we had Alison and Miss Tate saw each other for the first time last week. Miss Tate set a networking goal for this year. Alison confessed that she hated networking events. Miss Tate and Alison passed from small talk to small talk during lunch. Miss Tate mentioned three benefits of one-on-one -on -one networking meetings. Okay, guys, this is what you are going to do. I need you to tell me if they are true or false. If they are false, you need to tell me what's the correct answer, okay? Again, you go back to the groups. You're gonna have the same five minutes. Let's do it fast, please, please, because we have, today is many different activities. We are going to work with activities today. So, groups are open. Sandra, what happened to you? Who were your partners, Sandra? ¿Con quién iba? Hola, hola. Tuve un inconveniente, me, me salí, no escuché lo que dijo. Okay, no sé I'll, I'll send you to another group, le envío un grupo. Sí, por favor. Thank you. Hello, teacher. Hello, mister. Still working, right? Yes. No problem, no problem. You, que, you can listen. Fíjense que tengo, me han chocado una clase de la universidad. Okay, give me one second, give me one second. Dame un segundo. Okay.
es incorrecta. Falsa. Es falsa. Además, no, no veo que diga mi sei o sí. Ahí solo menciona un nuevo miembro. Ah, vaya, ellos, pero no dice, no, no lleva nombre. Y ahí, y ahí dice que se vieron tres veces, dice. Uh. En el seminario del año pasado, pero realmente no se conocían. O sea, no se conocían muy pista. bien. Ah. Um. ¿Y a dónde está el, según el párrafo? Al principio. Dice last week I had lunch with Alison. Yo creo que es falso. Es falso porque ellos no se ven cada, cada semana. Y dice que se vieron la primera vez. Un año antes, dice. El año pasado. Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces, falso. Oh, falso. Creo que falso. ¿Cómo es que es falso? False. False. For the first time, last. La segunda mistake, sí. I did work in golf for the chair. Yeah, no le Goal, que goal. For King was for sister for a uh, la segunda yo siento que es falsa tú. ¿A dónde está más o menos en el párrafo para dirigirnos? En el primer párrafo. Ajá. Porque si no me equivoco dice el año pasado. Ajá. Va a ir a pregunta dice. La, fijó una meta de trabajo. Oración. En el diálogo es pasado. Y la pregunta es como actual o en este caso en el tiempo que va no Ajá, sí. es pasado ¿el qué? en la segunda por eso está, pero la pregunta está dice hablando de tiempo pasado en el diálogo y dice fija una, año, una meta para este año Pichar el micrófono. Qué regañona. G, ¿cómo lo regañan a uno? Yes, look. <laughs> she said a she said a networking goal for this year. Yes, it's true. She set it up last year for this year. <laughs> Ella se puso la meta del año pasado, pero para este año. Oh. Oh. Mm. Planificación a largo plazo. Yes. Oh. Como la meta del nuevo año, la que siempre se hace. La que nunca se 
No sé, verdadero. Pruebe. Ok. Alison confesa. La tercera. Entonces la primera es falsa o verdadera. No. Está más tupido. Yo le puse falsa. Gaby. La primera. Uh -huh. Ajá. Si está la buena. Y la segunda también vea. Pongamos la que es verdadera porque dicen que es a largo plazo, planificación a largo plazo. Así como ahí está más dejado. Sí, está más cerradito. Andaba a tomar la medida con la cabeza, así con la mano. ¿Los demás qué dicen? ¿En cuál? Mira, sure. Un verdadero. Porque se está hablando acerca de, de largo plazo, yo creo que sí es verdadera. Sí, verdadera era. Así dijo el profe. ¿Es segundo? Sí. sí. ¿La primera la dejaron falsa? ¿O sí. verdadera? Falsa. Ok. ¿Y la tercera? Estoy viendo que ahí ella no dice que odia, solo dice que está, se aburre. Y eso ya sería aumentar, aumentarle que odia las reuniones. Porque ahí dice, durante el almuerzo, la comida, Alison menciona que ella estaba aburrida. Ese. Ella dice, she worried. Worried, creo que es. Falso. Sí, yo digo que es falso porque ella no dice que lo odia, solo dice de que, que yes, le aburre. Exactly. She doesn't no say interesante. that she hates it. She says that uh, it's not her team. Pero eso soy yo, pero oigo bien, sabes si está la voz del teacher. Así se escucha. ¿Verdad? Yo creí que era mi señal. Mm -hmm. well, let's see. No, but I got my microphone all the way up. Tengo el micrófono todo lo que da. Por ahí vaya. Pues no, voy a hablar más fuerte usted, teacher. I <laughs> am Estoy gritando. But the other microphone, you complain that you don't hear it. Pero el otro Pienso micrófono decir. dicen ustedes que es peor. This is the other microphone. ¿Qué dijo? Si usted sabe, porque yo no lo entendí. You see, that's the other microphone. Ese es el otro micrófono. No, pero en el otro se le oye como que está, no sé, metido en algo bien. Mucho eco. Atorada la voz. That's funny. <laughs> Okay, está guys. mejor así, se le oye bastante clara, solo que se lee bien al fondo. Ok, ok, ok. Well, yeah, because. Uh, yeah, yeah. Actually, no me grite, le usé el teacher. Actually, yeah. I am kind of yelling. I don't know what's the problem. I mean, I got the audio settings all the way up. Tengo todos wow. los settings. I got them all, all the way up. Salud. Gracias. Vayan la 4 es verdadera. Sí. sí, es verdadera. Verdadera.
Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm sorry, guys, I need to get the second attendance before we do the exercise. Let's see. Ana Consuelo Amaya Merino. Present, teacher. Ana Maria Rivas Durán. Present, teacher. Brenda Angélica Díaz de Chacón. Present, teacher. Karen Beatriz Castillo Sencente. Present teacher. Uh, David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez Lemus. Present. Guillermo Josué Osorio Ventura. Present teacher. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present teacher. José Edwin Valle Franco. Present teacher. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Karen Patricia Ramírez Pérez. Present teacher. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present teacher. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Roberto Antonio Guzmán Rodríguez. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present teacher. Ruth Margot Benítez Díaz. Present. Sandra Chamilet Alvarado Aguilar. Present teacher. Sonia Guadalupe Santa María Cabrera. Present teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. <coughs> Walter Manuel Reyes Campos. Present teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Ramos Escobar. Ok, ok. Okay, guys, let's see. Vamos a ver. Here we go. Okay. Alison and Miss Tate saw each other for the first time last week. Is that true or false? Let's see. Robert Beltran. Uh, I think it's true. It's true. Actually, it is true because, I mean, I had lunch with Alison, a new member of my network contact. So it's a new person for her. Yeah, I think so. Perfect. Excellent. Thank you. Now, let's see. Sandra, number two. Mistake set a networking goal for this year. Is that true or false? False. False. Why? Por qué? Por qué ahorita? If you look here, Hijo she, meta. Says, she says, okay, look at this. We really did not know each other very well. I set a goal last year. Me puse una meta el año pasado. I will have a one-on-one -on -one networking meeting with at least five new contacts this year. Here is the key. This year. So, she set a networking goal for this year. That's true. It's true, ¿verdad? Entonces, true. Yes. 
Okay, let's see. Allison confesses she hated networking events. Ana Consuelo, what's your opinion? Okay. During lunch, Allison mentioned that she was shy by nature. In the past, she Ajale, Jason, she no She worried a lot before going to large networking events. Okay. So she was shy by nature. She worried. Realmente ella dijo que se preocupaba. Okay. She didn't say she hated. It's just that she worried a lot. Se preocupaba mucho. Not necessarily that she hated the events. Okay. So in this case, it's false. Number four, Miss Tate and Allison pass from small talk to small talk during lunch. Let's see, David. Is that true or false? True. True. Exactly. Exactly. And the. Uh, because class. you see. She said, I got to know more about her, the industry she works in, and about her expectations for the future. That's not small talk. That's smart, smart talk. Right? Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Yes, tell me, tell me, tell me. I know the, the, the final and the guy more the new content, the past, the from the small talk and the smart talk. Perfect. Exactly. Yeah. You are right. The final, or actually, in this case, it's not the final. The end. The end. The end. Oh, thank you, Tisha. Okay, thank you. Give me one second. Ouch. <laughs> And the last one, Miss Tate mentioned three benefits of one-on-one -on -one networking events. Is that true or is that false, Karen Patricia? Teacher, cuál, cuál? The number five. It's true. It's true. Okay, what are the benefits she mentioned? What are the benefits? ¿Cuáles son los beneficios? En networking, coffee, lunch, or dinner. Okay, okay, okay. The benefits are this. You expand your contacts. You improve your networking skills and you build meaningful connections with people in the industry. Those are the benefits, okay? <laughs> Esos son los benefits. Okay, guys, let's see, we jump to the next. We got industry, staff, networking, branch, guest, headquarters, small talk, manufacture, personal expertise. Okay, we need to Choose five words from the word search and write a sentence per each. You are going to look for, you are going to choose five of these words and write me a sentence per each. Okay? Quiero cinco oraciones, una de cada palabra distinta. You pick five, escojan cinco. Okay? Working in groups, send them to the group. Me las envían al grupo, okay? I'm going to send you to the groups. Uh, That's a three minutes job. Ese es un trabajo de tres minutos. Es eh, uno por cada uno, teacher, o uno no, por no, grupo. No, no, no. Per group, just one activity. La actividad grupal es que como grupo me envían cinco oraciones. Ah, ok. Ok. Just one activity per group. There are two, four, six, eight, ten words. You are going to pick five. Escojan cinco nada más. Okay? 
Let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, groups are open. Okay, the sentences. No, you envied the image. No. Amarit, realmente en eso estoy. Give me a second. Ah. Ay, teacher, ay, teacher. What? You got your manual? Realmente ustedes tienen el manual. Ay, Mónica. Sí, lo vamos a pensar, lo vamos a pensar. Ajá. Pero... Ajá. Uh -huh. Ahí estamos. Hola. Una cada uno. No iban a compartir pantalla. ¿Ah? La pueden ver. No, dijo ya que la... cinco oraciones, o sea, el grupo total, todo el grupo. Por eh, eso, pero... Pick, pick one word, escojan una palabra cada uno. Uh -huh. Elijamos una cada uno. La realiza y después la compartimos aquí. Sí. A ver. Teacher, ya que está aquí. Está bien así la una oración. Ana Ramín es his manager. Ok, manager, manager. Yeah, but... You got to use one of these words. Tienen que usar una de estas palabras. Sí, aquí está industry. Let's see. Industry. Okay, okay. It's a manager at a clothes, clothing industry. Al revés. In the, in the, she's a manager in the clothing industry. Ok, sería manager in the... Clothing. No, clothing. ING, instead of ES. Clothing. Sí. Yes, in my city. Perfect. Hey, thank you, teacher. In the clothing industry in my city. Ok. Yo tengo una con la de sede. Ok. Ahorita la estaba escribiendo solamente. Entonces acudí la cama. Ahorita la 
Ya, pero bájale volumen a tu tono. No la sé. Jaime. Jaime. ¿Verdad? Está. Start of the training staff. Training. 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 Pero es que ya estuvimos. Ya, ya, ya utilizamos esas y la, me parece que analizamos la diferencia entre personal y personal. Ajá, uh -huh. es que pers personal, con el más prolongadito, es de una empresa, de, de un personal de, de trabajo, un grupo de trabajo. Y personal uh -huh. es como. Es como, de, como no, no, como, como cuando hablas personal. de algo, como cuando hablas de algo tuyo personal, así creo. Yes. Sí, es es como, exactly. como alguien tiene una... la corta, pero como cuando te referís a, digamos, a las personas de la planta, puedes utilizar este. El personal. Ajá. O staff. No, no, staff personal. no. Porque otro diferente que pusiera people, que era las personas, pero... Es personal. Es personal. Uh -huh. De ahí, branch es rama, ¿verdad? Y get... Wet es invitados. Hagamos una con wet, invitado. Ok. Están todos invitados para el 30 de febrero a las fiestas. Okay, just one little. Let me clarify something. Les aclaro algo. We use okay. staff when we are talking in singular or plural. Ok. I am part of the staff um, of the company, okay? okay? You use personal just when it's plural. Oh, okay. Got it? Is it, yes, it's a... Staff can be singular or plural. Personal uh, is yeah, just part. plural. Yeah. Okay, it's personal. And personal is personal, algo que me pertenece a mí, algo que es suyo, como, le, como decía acá David. Este, y si decimos que está Jaime a cargo del personal de entrenamiento. Oh, Jaime is in charge of the training personal. Uh, yes, Or pues sí. training staff. Because it's plural, you can use both. Así es que así la dejamos. Just remember, no, 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 staff no, no, no. can be like a little bit more informal. Staff puede tenerse un poquito más informal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, Tisha. Of the training personal. ¿Qué, le, ¿Qué les parece si nos lucimos con uno de los, de los, de los, ay, de lo que, de las capacitaciones de Link Manufacturing? Ah, oh, caballo. ¿Quién ha, re, ¿Quién ha recibido eso? Eh, ya la ya he recibido. Ah, entonces, Link Manufacturing, ah, pero es Manufacture. Manufacture. Yo tengo una duda. Ah, ya. Yeah. Jaime is in charge of the training personnel. Yeah. He is in charge of the, 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 the training. The training personnel. The training personnel. Personal. Personnel, no. Personal. El, el, el. Ok. En la tres, ¿cuál vamos a, a escoger, dijo? Get, lo que les decía son huéspedes. Ah, get, get will live on Friday. Así, así lo dejé yo. No sé si está bien. Yeah. Get. Get. Sería la siguiente después de brunch. No, no hemos hecho ni una de branch. 
Bueno, no escuché. No, no, la que está diciendo usted ahorita, GEF. Ah, sí, sí. Ah, es. Que si esa es la que vamos a aportar como la número 3, le pregunto. Sí. Ok. Eh, ¿Qué dice la número 3? Get will live on, on Friday. Friday. On Friday. Uh -huh. Ok. Live on Friday. Branch, yo, yo buscando me dice que es rama. Una rama de. Como un derivado, quizá. Ingeniería. No. <laughs> rama de. No, if you remember, no, I was explaining in the class that branch is also sucursal. Ah, uh, um, branch. Sucursal. No sé por qué me aparece así a mí. Because on a tree, a branch ah. es una rama. Porque en un árbol, una branch es una rama. Ajá, ya. Sí, me aparece branch. So branch means both things. Así que branch significa ambas cosas. Ajá. Ajá, branch office me da sucursal, pero branch así solito no. Y esa misma, esa misma frase en... En lo de la plataforma hay una pregunta sobre el banco y pone esa de, de branch. Yo en la primera vez me confundí también. Sixty seconds, guys, sixty seconds.
Okay, guys. I hope you all send your sentences. Espero que todos me envíen las oraciones. But before we move there, let's see. Robert Beltran, tell me one of your sentences, please. Okay. I tried, I wrote a sentence and it say like this. Um, I, I create a little bit sentence and is uh, I I I choose the word headquarters. Okay. Okay. It's it's like a question. Where is located the main headquarters of HBA? Okay. The main where is located in this case is where are located the main headquarters. Headquarters is plural. Ah, yeah, yeah, headquarters. Okay, so it's uh, Yeah, yeah, then. Okay, entonces it's my mistake. Just little words. It's my just mistake. Little words. Yeah, I'm gonna erase that S at the end of the word. Exactly, exactly. Thank, thank you, Fisher. My pleasure. Let's see. Uh, Ana Consuelo, tell me one of yours. Uh, are the quest satisfied with the service that is paid offered? Okay, thank you. Uh, Fatima Laura, one of your sentences, please. Hello, teacher. Me repite que no le escucho por la lluvia. Can you give me one of your sentences? Puede darme una de sus oraciones. Okay. HBI Manufacture Clothes. Okay, repeat please. HBI Heinbank in Manufacture Clothes. Okay, Manufacture Clothes. Perfect, thank you. Uh, 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 um. Karen Patricia. Yes, teacher. One of yours, please. We focus on begging the best in the industry. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Catherine, your turn. Let's see. Catherine Guadalupe. Aquí estoy. Perdón. No problem. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Uh, the no, the material for the manufacture of chairs is cotton. No sé cómo es el godo. Cotton. Cotton. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Walter Reyes. There is a meeting with the staff at 3 p.m. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Jose Edwin. Uh, Roxana Ramirez is manager in the clothing industry in my city. Perfect. Ana Maria. Yes, teacher. One of your sentences, please. We focus on the being the best in the industry. Perfect. Uh, Brenda Diaz. Hello, teacher. One of your sentences. 
in the world, there are communication channels. One of the starting with my staff. Perfect. Sandra Alvarado. Sandra, one of your sentences. Hola. One of your sentences, please. Eh, no las anoté, mis compañeras las anotaron. Okay, ok. Lo siento, y me pasa algo. No problem, no problem. Ok, guys. Well, next exercise. Again, writing. Today is many writing exercises. We go back to the manual. Same idea. We got to do write five information questions in the simple present using the verbs in the box. So one question per word. You see? Remember, information questions. If you remember yesterday, I was explaining to you information questions. What, where, when, who, why. Okay? And at the same time, we are going to do exercise three and four. We have to order the words to create positive, negative, and interrogative statements in the simple past. So we are going to do from the manual, from page 28, exercise three and exercise four. Okay? We're going to have exactly 10 minutes because then we have to come here and solve the exercise. Okay? So we got around. Today is a lot of writing. If you notice, today has been reading and writing, reading and writing. So let's do it. Teacher, una de cada una sería. Yes, please, please. As a group, sería... como grupo, como grupo, ok. So you choose Nadie one. Nadie contesta. Gabriela teacher. chooses one, Brenda another one, Monica another. Ok. It's one per, it's five per group. Son cinco como grupo, ok. So, pick one word each. Esco, repártanse las palabras. And then you share here. Y luego se las comparten. That's easier. Así es más fácil. Brenda, okay. Mónica. Hello. Hello. So, each one say your word. Cada uno diga su palabra. Eh... Disculpe, yo no estaba poniendo atención ya en lo último. Ajá. Es que lo que pasa es que el niño empezó como a toser y me levanté de un solo. Y, y, solo, y después oí que decían Sandra, Sandra. 
y corriendo. Okay, hold on, hold on. I am sharing, estoy tratando de compartirles la screenshot, la captura para que puedan realizar el trabajo. Yo tengo ahorita el, el libro abierto. Ok, that's perfect. Le voy a compartir a las chicas. Excellent, it's page 28, página 28. It's easy. What you gotta do is each one of you picks one word. Cada una escoge una palabra and do the exercise and do one sentence. Entonces es una oración por cada una. It's five sentences per group. Son cinco oraciones por grupo. Ah, okay. Eh, siempre utilizando estas palabras. Yes. The instruction says, write five information questions in the simple present. Use the verbs from the box, usando el vocabulario del recuerdo. Okay. Okay. Vamos a escribir preguntas en presente simple. Así es. Por ejemplo, la 345. La primera. presente simple el supervisor o verse como supervisar verdad oversee sí yes. oversee supervisar y yes, sí, la podría quedar una pregunta como he oversee the work no what does he oversee qué es lo que él supervisa remember questions information questions o sea que tienen que iniciar con what where who tienen que iniciar con What? una de las WH questions. Yo dije who over si. Ok, that's perfect. How often? Call me to find you. You. Assistant. <laughs> Network is ready, Okay, sí. network, Thanks. network. Remember that we are using the term to refer. Estamos utilizando el término para referirnos, sí, a una red, pero a una red de contactos. Oh. Usted tenga for business. Mm. Okay, a network. Podría ser. Do you attend, no assistance, sino que es attend. Aten, oh, okay. Aten. A T E N. Así. Doble T no yo. Ah, ten. estoy perdido ahorita. Okay. How often do you attend network uh, train training? A ver, ayuda, ayuda, ayuda. <laughs> <laughs> network. Train. Aquí, teacher. Yes, sí, yes. Hello, hello. Uh, what do you think about this sentence? Tell me, tell me, tell uh, me. I, it says, I supervise my partner is work in the morning. I supervise. Oh, okay, let's do it like this. Look, let me, let me just add a little bit. Déjeme agregarle algo más. Uh, I supervise my 
partners is work in the morning. Work in the morning. Look. The apostrophe is, in this case, el trabajo de mi compañero. Exactly. El apostrofe That's es, right. en este caso, está expresando posesión. No That's sacar. right. Entonces, no es que el apostrofe S sea is. Mm -hmm. El is eh, no aplica en este caso. Sería para progresión, vea, vea que está incorrecto. Va. Lo que pasa es que eh, supervise es el verbo, supervisar. Sí. My partner's work in the morning. En este caso, la palabra work no está funcionando como verbo, sino como nombre. Porque usted está diciendo Ajá. el trabajo, lo que se ejerce. Uh -huh. Buena, buena, teacher. No sé si, Gracias, si, si me expliqué, Walter. Yes, yes. Ok, perfect, perfect. Excellent. I came right in the moment. Vine cabal en el momento preciso. Yeah, thank you. Ah, oh, thanks to you. Y que fíjate que no le saqué la foto, por lo que... John oversees the production line in the company. Robert, just one little detail. Solo un pequeño detallito. Ok. okay. Overseas. If you notice, you have written overseas. Y eso quiere decir eh, mm, al otro oh. lado del océano. Oh, lo siento, lo siento. Do you supervise the construction, Monica? Fue lo único que se me ocurrió. No, it's okay. <laughs> I'm just wondering if you supervise the construction. Yo solo me pregunto si usted lo hace. Sí. Si supervisa cuando hacen alguna cosa aquí en la casa, ¿por qué no ayuda? Okay, so you are very good at supervising. <laughs> Se me quiebra las uñas, teacher. Ajá. Uh -huh. Oye. Oh, sí. No comments. Perfect, Robert. Excellent. En John, después de la J, J, no va a H. O va la O primero. ¿Dónde, dónde, dónde? dónde, dónde? En, en el nombre... John, J-O-H-N, J-H-O-N, it varies, varía. Ah. No dejan que Max salga vagar, hombre. Why not? ¿Por qué no? Perdón, chicas, que no estuve apoyándoles. Pero es que estaba queriendo dormir al niño y no me dejo. ¿Por qué no deja dormir al niño? Pues ya lo tenía durmiendo, pero no se quiere dormir fregado. Ay, no. Pero bien, ya lo saqué aquí afuera. Así que a ver, que me ayudan, me explican qué es lo que vamos a hacer. ¿Qué palabra eligió usted?
Okay, David, one of your sentences, please. David Armando. Okay, let's see, Ruth. Can you help me? I did you. Your sentence, su oración, tell me. Who will supervise the new staff? Who will supervise? Supervise. Supervise. Excellent. Thank you. Uh, now, Fatima. Hello. Your sentence, please. Su oración. What does the supervisor do? The supervisor. The supervisor. Thank you, Robert Guzman. Hello, Robert. Can you give me your sentence, please? John oversees the company, the production line in the company. Perfect. Thank you. Now, let's see, uh, Karen Castillo. Okay, uh, where does Claudio oversee? Perfect. Karen Patricia? Oops, I lost her. Uh, 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 uh. Carla Beatriz? No. <laughs> we <laughs> we are in charge of the outdoor activity. Outdoors, outdoors. Outdoor. Perfect. Outdoor Thank you. Activity. Ana Thank Consuelo. You, the network is on table while they Excellent, Gabriela Vázquez. Yes. Mr. John is in chair of checking the production. Perfect. Robert Beltrán. Okay. Uh, Jayo oversees the whole line production. Perfect. Thank you. Jaime. Yes. Your sentence. Uh, um, why we oversee the production? Okay, Catherine. What department do you supervise? Perfect. Roxana? What manufacture in HV? Okay, perfect. Thank you guys very much. I know that all of you have. We still want, got one exercise missing. Todavía tenemos un ejercicio pendiente. That's for tomorrow. And let me get the final attendance because it's time. Ana Consuelo Amaya Merino. Uh, Ana María Rivas Durán. Brenda Angélica Díaz de Chacón. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Castillo Sensente. Present teacher. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher.
Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez Lemos. Presente. Guillermo Josué Osorio Ventura. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present teacher. Thank you, Jaime. José Edwin Valle Franco. Present. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Uh, I'm here, teacher. Thank you, mister. Karen Patricia Ramírez Pérez. Carla Beatriz García. No respira cerca del micrófono, se escucha feo. Present teacher. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Gabriel. Eh, Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardón Hernández. Thank you, José Guillermo. Eh, Roberto Antonio Guzmán Rodríguez. Guillermo José, I'm sorry. Present. Thank you, Mr. Guzmán. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present, teacher. Thank you, Roxana. Ruth Margot Benítez Díaz. Present, teacher. Thanks. Sandra Chamilet Alvarado Aguilar. Present, teacher. Thank Bye. you. Sonia Guadalupe Santa María Cabrera. Present, teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Walter Manuel Reyes Campos. And Xiomara Elizabeth Ramos Escobar. Hey guys, don't forget the platform. Don't forget the platform. Today we finish section two and midterm. Okay. No olvidemos la plataforma. Hoy terminábamos section two y el midterm. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Good night, Gabriela. Have a good one. Take care. Let's see. Yeah. Brenda. Bye. Good night. Ah, Brenda, Brenda, Brenda. Where's Brenda? Ana Maria. Mm -hmm. Oh, Ana Maria, it's okay. Fátima, let me see. Good. Karen Castillo. Ooh, Karen. Good night, Karen, teacher. Karen, Karen, Karen Castillo. Good night, Katherine. Have a good one. Take care. Teacher. Yes. Una pregunta. En la segunda actividad me confundí. Era hacer preguntas o hacer oraciones. Questions. Using the WH questions. Preguntas haciendo. Preguntas eran verdad. WH. Yes. Oh. Ok. Let's y see. también nos íbamos a mandar al grupo. Yes, please. Necesito okay. ayuda con la plataforma. Ok, Sandra. ¿Qué desea ahorita al final? Solo se desconectan los compañeros. Le atiendo. Pero en las que han mandado ahí en el grupo no le han puesto las WS Question. Sí, pero todavía no las he revisado, my dear. Yo las reviso hasta que termina la clase. Es pero que eso me confundió aún más todavía. Es, sí, pero yo les di la indicación. Y si usted se fija, la indicación en el ejercicio dice específicamente, y permítame solo. Deme un segundo, este, Sandra. Okay. Eh, eh, mire, Fátima, aquí dice, write five information questions. Mire, information questions. Aquí está la indicación. In the simple present. Use the verbs from the box, utilizando los verbos que hay en el recuadro. Uh -huh. Y por eso les decía yo, utiliz, in, iban a iniciar con what, where, when, who, how. ¿Sí? Sí, es que eso ya lo tenía claro yo, pero ya donde vi los ejemplos que estaban dando, ahí fue donde yo me confundí. No, 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 don't worry, but it's WH. 
Usted me tiene que enviar WH, ¿ok? Ok. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Good night. <coughs> Is there any other question, guys? ¿Hay otra preguntita? Yo solo un comentario, teacher. Dígame, dígame, David. Como no, nosotros en la planta vamos, vamos a salir de vacaciones esta semana. Entonces voy de noche mañana y el jueves ahí posiblemente solo esté como oyente. No problem, David. You can check out the class later and ask me anytime. Usted puede revisar la clase luego y me pregunta cualquier duda. You can text me, ¿ok? Puede escribirme, no problem. Thank you, teacher. Good night. No, no. my pleasure. Teacher. Yes. Yo y que me mencionó, no sé si es que para quedarme o solo para Para rectificar. mañana la tengo programada, Brenda. Ah, ok, teacher, está bien. Good night, teacher. Good night. Ok. Ok, vaya, dígame. Eh, eh, en la plataforma, en la tarea 7. Ajá, denme un segundo, sí. tengo que buscar la tarea número. 7. Ok, vamos a ver. Ah, 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 ah. Tarea 7, dice. Sección 2, ¿verdad? De la 1. Oh, Tengo pendiente. Perdón, perdón. Oh, no, la tarea... Ok, la tarea 7 es en la sección 2. No, oh, sí, 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 perdón. Sí, de la sección 2. Ajá. Las instrucciones dice que complemente haciendo preguntas. No, dice read the information, type a proper question. Dice que vea la información que está ahí y escriba una pregunta de manera correcta. Como por ejemplo, la primera usted tiene what, this machine y do. Ajá. ¿Verdad? Entonces, y ahí le dice que no olvide el uso de los auxiliares, de los auxiliares. Todas son en presente. Cuando se refiere a los auxiliares, está hablando del do y del das. Como por ejemplo, en la primera sería así, mire. What does this machine do? Es que lo ingreso así. What does this, this machine do? Lo ingrese más. Lo ingreso así. What does this machine do? Solo así. Okay. Lo ingresa ahorita. Ok, so. Entonces solo le estaría agregando como el does o el do. Yes, exactly. Look. Who does she meet on Saturday? Entonces la segunda me quedaría como does y la tercera Who? como do. How many people, how many people does? Does. Porque está hablando de ella. Does she supervise? El sujeto es she. Ok. La única que usted va a hacer con do es la última. Ok. Y también tengo otra. Pero creo que la voy a intentar hacer. La voy a intentar hacer. Dígame cuál, dígame cuál. Es la... La nueve, la diez. Creo que es ahorita la busco. Traté de avanzar el fin de semana porque al menos hay unas... En las que, en las que si me equivoco, ¿verdad? Me da la oportunidad de corregir, pero en estas. No creo que sea. la oportunidad de hacerlo de nuevo. De hacerlo de nuevo. Sí. Y, y aprender, ¿verdad? En sí, estas. Pues. O sea, una parte. Eh, ahorita. En la cuatro es. En la cuatro de la parte. En la cuatro. Sí. Estamos hablando de la... Sección 2 siempre. 
sección 2. Ok, no, pero es que la sección 2 inicia con tarea 6. Ajá. 7, 8, 9, 10. ¿Cuál de ellas? Pero dice, mmm, apoya la sección 2, pero dice parte 1. Ah, no, entonces usted ya está en el midterm. Parte 1, sección 2, midterm, part 1. Ajá, la parte 1 ya la hice, sería la parte 4. Ok, part number 4. Solo explíqueme las instrucciones. ¿no? Vaya, la, está dividida en dos partes. Ajá. La primera parte dice, with the information in brackets, type a correct question. Con la información que está ahí, tiene que escribir usted una pregunta de manera correcta. Lo mismo. Lo mismo, solo activar los auxiliares. Sí. Ok. Y en, la, en el ejercicio 4, usted solamente va a marcar cuál es la respuesta correcta. Ajá, en la parte de abajo. Uh -huh. Ok. Está bien, entonces. Le agradezco mucho. No, my pleasure. That's why we're here. Para eso estamos. Ok. Muchas gracias por su Have tiempo. Good night. No Good problem. night. No problem. Good night.